I'm going to show you how to do uh, the circular pattern tool. Um, so this is a practice sketch. So I'm going to go ahead and make a new part. Make a two-dimensional sketch on it. I'm going to start out with a construction line from the center point. And we're going to use that construction line to revolve. Um, I'm going to come up and put a point right here and I'm going to dimension that point and it should be 0.375 this is going to be the starting point for our sketch and so I'll base everything um, from that point I'll click off of the construction line and get an actual modeling line and I'll go up from there so from this point we should go up 0.625 we'll go over 0.5 We'll go up from there, 1.125 over 0.5, and we'll come down and connect back to that starting point. Um, so when you're done with that, you can go ahead and finish the sketch. We're going to use the revolve tool again to revolve this sketch around this axis so you get this nice shape like that and you go ahead and click OK from that we're going to go ahead and um, create another new sketch on here I'm going to create a series of holes on our object so I'm going to put a point in right on that line I'll dimension it to the center point of this and our uh, drawing tells us it should be 1.65 so I'll go ahead and dimension that finish the sketch then I'll use the hole tool to make a 0.5 inch diameter hole that goes through all and I'll click apply um, from that we can go ahead and, and create our pattern and use the circular pattern tool and so it's right here. You can go ahead and click on that. With the circular pattern tool, the first thing it wants you to do is select a feature. So I'll select the feature I want to pattern. Then I can select a rotation. I want it to rotate around this axis. So they're going to go from the center point we created. And let's say we want 10 of those to go around there. We want them to go all the way around, so 360 degrees. Go ahead and click OK. And that gives us uh, the part that we wanted to create using the circular pattern tool. So you'll want to make sure you go ahead and save that as circular pattern um, in your geometry of design folder.